Hey, what's going on guys? It's Alex here from Simple Mods and welcome back to another video. Before I get into some new builds and content on this channel, I think it's about time I sort out my main rig and get it back up and running 100%. Then hopefully I can enjoy some gaming on it as well and not have a hard time trying to video edit with it. Fortunately, three of the fans inside it started rattling pretty badly and also the DDC pump is acting up as well. So I'll be taking care of those um, in this video. Now this is my Project Shady case mod in the Inwin D-Frame Mini that I built back in 2017 and I've actually been using it as my daily rig since. I'll be putting some links down in the video description uh, to a few videos I did of it at the time if you guys want to see more about how I built it and also what this project means to me. If you've been following uh, my channel um, for a while, if you've been a long time subscriber or a follower of my work, um, you'll know that I dedicated this build to my dog Shady that uh, passed away in 2016. The main specs inside it are dual GTX 1080 Ti Founders Edition graphics cards, an Asus X99M workstation motherboard that's rocking the i7-6950X CPU with 32 gigs of 3200 MHz G-Skill Trident Z RGB DDR4 RAM, a 1TB Samsung 960 EVO M.2 SSD, 900W in-wind power supply with custom Cable Mod Pro cables and a whole lot of EK water blocks water cooling gear, including their 10th anniversary EK Supremacy EVO gold CPU water block that pretty much sparked the color scheme around the entire build. So as you can tell from the specs, it's definitely a pretty solid system and I have no need to upgrade at the moment. I play on a 3440 by 1440 ultra wide monitor and it pretty much smashes through any game I throw at it, as you would expect with SLI 1080 Ti's. The main issue is that I only have one fan spinning in there um, at the moment and the other three started rattling sort of one by one and it got so bad that I actually had to stick some tape inside the fan blades to stop them from spinning and making the annoying um, rattling sound that they were making. Plus the pump also has some issues where sometimes it doesn't start up with the system which is definitely a problem so I'll be swapping that out as well. I picked up four of these Corsair ML120 Pro white LED fans. These are the magnetic levitation fans from Corsair. They look pretty sweet and I'm pretty sure they'll perform pretty good as well as they do have pretty high static pressure. And they also offer some more lighting um, inside the system as well. Honestly, fans are the last thing I ever thought I'd have issues with inside a build. I'm not sure what went wrong with the 120 millimeter EK Vada fans that I currently have in there. I did get them from EK um, right on launch, um, so maybe there was a few issues with some with some bad samples in there. But other than the fans and the issue with the pump playing up, there's also been some buildup in the reservoir. And with it being on the back side, I only sort of noticed recently when I moved the system to another room. So my best bet with this is that the buildup inside the reservoir was from the adhesive um, used to actually put the reservoir together must have just had a bad reaction with the coolant um, and the other properties inside the loop. It was the only reservoir I could make work at the time of building the system. However, I've now picked up one of these Fantex Glacier R160 reservoirs. They are pretty low profile and can fit a DDC pump directly to it. So I'll be installing this in the system as well and checking out all of the um, water blocks and everything, making sure everything's in right condition, um, giving the radiators uh, a nice clean, putting the system back together and hopefully um, it should be back up and running. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and the footage. Chuck us a like if you do, subscribe for more and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.
just want you to know that I was in there for you. I just want you to know that I was in there for you. I just want you to know that I was in there for you. I just want you to know that I was in there for you. I just want you to know that I was in there for you. I just want you to know that I was in there for you. I just want you to know that I wasn't there for you. <laughs>